Tim, what did you make of Liverpool after that shaky start? Well, you know, when you look at teams who press, and I, I think Bournemouth pressed really well from the front, you have to be able to persevere through those tough moments because ultimately teams can't press for 90 minutes. So I think once they settled down, started creating tempo, it was good. They need to get their front, front men scoring. Jota, Salah, Diaz, they all got on the score sheet. In the end, it's a good day. Were you disappointed in Bournemouth a little bit that they couldn't keep it up a bit longer? A little bit. I mean, they started really, really well and made Liverpool a little bit anxious, a little bit nervous. But as soon as Liverpool got through that first 15, 20 minutes, total control. I think we all know that they've got great front players. They're all looking bright, looking sharp. Luis Diaz, two goals in two. Uh, Dominic Subaslai, again, classy, easy, never gives the ball away, creative. A minutes for Endo as well. So, you know, poor start, but the rest of the game... Impressive. McAllister sent off. We saw Endo, as Robbie says, come on. What did you make of the new Liverpool signing? Well, I think it's a tough, a tough situation to come into, particularly when you're down a man. But again, he's going to play at the base of that midfield. I thought he did well in terms of keeping the ball moving. That's, that's what that, that position, that profile calls for. Keep the ball ticking over, making sure you're covering. He did the job. Rob? Yeah, I mean, so early, so early. I mean, he's going to sit back in there. He's just going to keep... I didn't see him give the ball away. He just gives it to all the attacking talent around him. So I think he'll, he'll work out great. Hi there, I'm Rebecca Lowe, studio host for NBC's coverage of the Premier League. Don't forget to hit subscribe to watch more videos all season long. For even more Premier League content, from original series to live matches, head over to Peacock and be sure to tune in for Premier League mornings every weekend on USA Network and on Peacock. We will see you over there.